The Legacy of Hope. A Great Venture by Bonaventure. Jobwa darling, please don't be bitter. All those earthly possessions and relationships were all gifts from God. And God has no obligation to protect me from losing them. I'm sure these losses are just temporary. But even if they are not, I will continue to praise God for his goodness and justice. I look forward to coming home and seeing you soon. Your loving husband, Job. Job you silly sentimental slob. You cannot come home because there is no home. The bank just foreclosed on your property. We're now homeless. The only thing I must thank God for is that there is nothing worse that could happen to us anymore. Signed, Jobwa. Hello brothers and sisters in Christ. For our Bonaventure Challenge today, I reflect with you on the theme, Hold on Tight, from Joshua chapter 23, verse 8 to 16. Joshua was at the end of his life. He had gone through it all, and he had this advice for the Israelites to hold on tight. My dear friends in Christ, a life indeed can be very challenging. Life sometimes can be very difficult, and indeed sometimes very unfair. In such moments, you need something to hold on to. You need someone to be there for you. If you are not careful, you will just clutch at a straw. But you need a solid rock, like Jesus Christ, who would always be by your side. Think about the life of Job. He was a very rich man. He had many children. He had properties. But he lost everything. But although he lost everything, there was one person in his life that he held on to. That was his God. Even when friends and wife was accusing him, he was so solid because he had someone he was holding on to, and that was God. My dear friends in Christ, life can also throw us such things. We may have challenges with our health. We may lose years of property. We may even lose our job. But in such moments, Joshua says, hold on tight, because indeed, it is God who is our refuge and our strength. When you go through such moments, know that indeed the anchor that you can hold on to is your God. I bless you today and I pray that you may always hold on to your God so tight so that in moments like these, you may have someone coming to rescue the God that you serve. We'll never disappoint you. They indeed be your solid rock. Amen. Amen.